So hi friend, this is Amit and you are watching my channel information and educational video. So in this video, I will talk about the paper analysis of 25th July of JE mains phase 3 examination shift 1. As you all know, the shift 1 is completed now. So here I am with the analysis of the paper. So here I will talk about the difficulty level of the each subject and overall difficulty and which topic have more number of questions according to the student reaction. So and also I will provide you the expected marks versus percentile. I will also provide you the expected cutoff marks for the JE advanced exam for each category that is a general OBC, SC, ST, EW, SO. So please try to watch this video till the end so that you will get the information about topic with more question and the topic which are easy that you should cover if your shift is next. And if you are first to my channel, please try to subscribe this channel so that you will get the complete information about JE mains and other entrance exam, other counseling also in this channel. And very soon I will provide you all the video related to the cutoff of JE mains 2021. And the safe was score to get the NIT, top NIT with CS or lower NIT with CS or core branches and triple IT, GFTI also. So stay tuned for that video. And so please, let's start this video. So here is the July 25 shift 1 analysis. I have already done the previous shift analysis. You can check the video in the i button as well as in the description box. In my each shift analysis, you will get the marks versus percentile data and the expected cutoff marks for the J advance also. So try to watch all those, uh, all those videos so that you will have the complete information. So here is the first point of the of this analysis is math was moderate and lengthy as similar to the earlier earlier shift that is math is the toughest among all the three subjects and it was lengthy and this time it was so calculative so it takes so much time so it is not so much a scoring as as always. If you talk about the number of easy question that is 9 from the topics such as probability, matrices, determinant, th vector 3D. So you have to cover this, syllab uh, this syllabus if you are targeting the next uh, attempt of the J that is the fourth attempt. So you should cover uh, those chapters because, because those chapters will provide you so many easy questions that you can easily solve without wasting any, uh, so much time. So and the moderate number of questions were 11 and tough was 10. So this is about the math paper. Now talk about the physics. Physics was moderate to easy this time. Earlier it was moderate. In today's paper, physics was moderate to easy. So now if you talk about the easy question, uh, number of easy question we are 10. That is from a mod modern physics. So, so if your shift is next or if you are targeting the next phase of the examination, I would suggest go for the modern physics because it requires very less time and it is very a scoring. You will get five to six questions from uh, modern physics in each shift of the paper. So please try to cover the modern physics paper so that you will uh, you can uh, score more marks in the upcoming shift. So a uh, moderate a moderate question we are thirteen and tough we are seven question. Now talk about the chemistry. So chemistry was easiest as expected among the three subjects. Chemistry was easy as earlier case. The, uh, in this in this shift also chemistry was the easiest. So if you talk about the easy question, it is 12, moderate, 13 question, tough, 5 question. So now let me clear one point that is the syllabus is uniformly distributed. In each subject, there was uh, there was one or more than one question from each topic. So you have to cover any topic that you uh, that you have interest or that you have covered already. Try to revise that because you will get the question in that topic. Don't go to the other topic you don't know because there will be question from each topic. So just focus on the topic that you know very well. So the next point is overall paper paper uh, difficulty level was moderate. So you can expect that there will be similarity in the marks versus percentile data that I have provided in previous shift. So all paper have the similarity. So you can expect similar type of pattern will be followed in the next shift also the, on 27th July also. So you can you can prepare according to that. So now if you talk about where you can get the NIT, triple IT, GFPI cutoff category wise. So you can check uh, on my channel playlist. There will be there is different playlist for different type of video is available. You can check all the videos so that you can you can estimate yourself which type of college with which branch you can get. Uh, that is category wise uh, cutoff is available. So you just need to go to my channel playlist so that you will get all, all the information. So now if you talk about the expected cutoff marks and percentile for the JE advanced examination. So percentile will, will remain same but the marks depend according to the difficulty level of the paper. So here is the marks and percentile that you need to score in order to be eligible for the JE advanced exam. So if you talk about general category it is 115 to 118 and rest you can check, uh, you can check uh, by pausing this video. So the next if you talk about marks versus percentile because this is the important once your exam is clear you want to know about the percentile that you can get. So here is the information regarding the marks versus percentile. So here is the data. So you can check all the data by pausing this video. I'm not going to discuss all the thing because video will be so long. So you can check by pausing this video. There is some more information for marks versus percentile. So 
here you can check by pausing this video again so this is the information so this is all about the analysis of the 25th july so first shift uh, paper analysis so i will provide you the similar video for second shift also so please try to subscribe this channel and try to share this video to your friends so that they can also get this information and i will also provide you the safe score for nit triple it and gfti very soon so please try to subscribe and share this video to your friends thanks